So when I saw the massage therapy program um, being marketed, I saw it on a billboard and I was like, oh my gosh, Douglas is getting a massage program now. When COVID happened and the teaching field kind of changed a little bit, I decided, you know, I'm gonna go back and pursue something that I've always been interested in. I think that when I came into the massage program, I was looking at it as like a relaxing kind of thing that will alleviate stress. What I didn't realize is that the thorough education that um, we get here involves a lot of anatomy and physiology, something very different than I had ever learned before. I wouldn't say it was hard, but it was challenging for me. But because of it, I'm able to do my job really well now. You get the education, but you also get the other part of it, the, the part where you're connecting with people. Everything that Amanda teaches, she teaches at an empathetic level. And she maybe more so shows um, how to strengthen your empathy where maybe you didn't have it before. And that's, that's very important for this business. It's very important to be able to target a person's pain, not only from the actual physical level, but also at an emotional one too. And that's something that I think we all had to learn in class. We started hands-on fairly early on. It helps everybody to get to know each other really quickly and be comfortable with everyone really quickly. There was a good flow and it built up and it built up as our comfort level built up. The point where we were ready when we went into clinic and we had worked with each other so much, we had a very nice close-knit comfort level within the classroom. Amanda, our teacher, she prepared us for scenarios that we may face. You always think in the back of your head, well, that's never gonna happen to me. She very much prepared us for real world, real life situations, um, things we may face that are positive and things that we may face that, you know, generally may be a little bit uncomfortable discussing with the clients. It was a very thorough education. Many of my classmates did work with career services, and of course I communicated with career services what my plan was, but I had been seeing my chiropractor and noticed that my chiropractor needed a massage therapist, so I kind of took it upon myself to ask her if I could shadow while I was in school, but I decided to take one day, a Friday afternoon, and work with the chiropractor's patients to gain some of my own experience before I was done with school, so um, I generally just fell right into the position once I graduated. So I'm working here at DEC one day a week um, as an adjunct instructor because the school is such a great place that I didn't want to leave. Having my teaching background, I am here on Wednesdays doing professional skills workshop. But beyond that, I am at Mon City Chiropractic and with Dr. Linda Bichelia working under her. And on Thursdays and Saturdays, I have the building to myself to serve my own private clientele. I had no idea that when I came into this, I would be so much more akin to a medical type massage, a medical type background. And you know, we learned every style here in our class. I just kind of gravitated toward that. Uh, I get a lot of fulfillment out of helping people that are going through things, whether it be something physical or something mental that's manifesting itself as a physical condition, because both physical and mental can cause the same type of pain. It just sort of became my wheelhouse. It sort of became very fulfilling to help people through those times. You definitely have to come in with not only an open mind, but an open heart. You're connecting with people. And so um, you have to really know and be able to reach people on an intimate level. They're placing their trust in you to help them. You want to make sure that you really know how to connect with people in an appropriate way, um, in a professional way. And this program has an edge up on a lot of other, maybe a lot of other massage programs to where the teacher is a person who's able to do that.